Hey, they're all beloved viewers. Welcome back to another Healthy Lifestyle Supports Channels video. Once upon a time, coconut water was only to be found in health stores. Now, this drink is so mainstream that it can be purchased from almost every grocery store. How often do you drink coconut water or eat its meat? Coconut is the fruit of the coconut palm, Cocos nucifera. It's used for its water, milk, oil, and tasty meat. Coconuts have been grown in tropical regions for more than 4,500 years, but recently increased in popularity for their flavor, culinary uses, and potential health benefits. So, in today's video we will talk about the best health benefits of coconut and side effects. Let's explore together in the video from the beginning to end. Number 1. Type of coconut products. The raw white meat inside a coconut is referred to as the kernel. It has a firm texture and delicious, slightly sweet flavor. If you have a whole coconut, you can scrape the raw meat out of the shell and eat it. In its processed form, you'll usually find it sliced, shaved, or grated. Coconut milk and cream are made by pressing the raw, grated meat. Dried coconut meat is usually grated or shaved and used in cooking or baking. It can be further processed and ground into flour. Coconut oil is also extracted from the meat. In short, coconut meat is tasty and slightly sweet, and you can enjoy it raw or dried. Many related products are produced from it, including coconut milk, cream, and oil. Number 2. High Nutrition Facts Unlike many other fruits that are high in carbs, coconuts provide mostly fat. They also contain protein, several important minerals, and small amounts of B vitamins. However, they're not a significant source of most other vitamins. The minerals in coconut are involved in many functions in your body. Coconuts are especially high in manganese, which is essential for bone health, and the metabolism of carbohydrates, proteins, and cholesterol. They're also rich in copper and iron, which help form red blood cells, as well as selenium, an important antioxidant that protects your cells. Here are the nutrition facts for 1 cup or 100 grams of raw and dried coconut meat. Raw coconut meat. 354 calories while dried coconut meat is 650 calories protein 3 grams for raw coconut meat but dried coconut meat protein is 7.5 grams carbohydrates 15 grams for raw coconut meat whilst dried coconut meat is 25 grams fiber in raw coconut meat is 9 grams but dried coconut meat is 19 grams fat in raw coconut meat is 33 grams but dried coconut meat is up to 65 grams. Manganese in raw coconut meat is 75% of the daily value, but dried coconut meat is up to 137% of the daily value. Copper in raw coconut meat is 22% of the daily value, whilst a dried coconut meat is 40% of the daily value. Selenium in raw coconut meat is 14% of the daily value, whilst dried coconut meat is 26% of the daily value. Raw coconut meat contains magnesium 8% of the daily value, whilst dried coconut meat contain 23% of the daily value. Raw coconut meat contain phosphorus. 11% of the daily value, but dried coconut meat contain 21% of the daily value. Raw coconut meat contains iron. 13% of the daily value, whilst a dried coconut meat is 18% of the daily value. Whereas, potassium in raw coconut meat is 10% of the daily value, whilst dried coconut meat is 16% of the daily value. Much of the fat in coconut is in the form of medium-chain triglycerides, MCTs. Your body metabolizes medium-chain triglycerides differently than other types of fats, absorbing them directly from your small intestine, and rapidly using them for energy. One review on the benefits of medium-chain triglycerides in people with obesity found these fats may promote body fat loss when eaten in place of long-chain saturated fats from animal foods. In short, although coconut meat is high in fat, the medium-chain triglycerides it contains may help you lose excess body fat. The meat also provides carbs and protein along with many essential minerals, such as manganese, copper, iron, and selenium. Number 3. May Benefit Heart Health 
Studies have found that people who live on Polynesian islands and frequently eat coconut meat have lower rates of heart disease than those who follow a Western diet. However, native Polynesians also eat more fish and less processed foods, so it's unclear if these lower rates are due to eating coconut or other aspects of their diet. Another study in 1,837 Filipino women found that those who ate more coconut oil not only had higher levels of HDL, good, cholesterol but also higher levels of LDL, bad, cholesterol and triglycerides. Overall, it concluded that coconut oil has a neutral effect on cholesterol levels. Consuming virgin coconut oil, which is extracted from dried coconut meat, may reduce belly fat. This is especially beneficial, because excess belly fat increases your risk of heart disease and diabetes. A study in 20 people with obesity, found the waist size of male participants decreased by an average of about 1 inch, about 3 centimeters, after they consumed 1 ounce, equal 30 milliliters, of virgin coconut oil daily for 4 weeks. The female participants did not experience a significant reduction. However, in one longer study, women who consumed 1 ounce, 30 milliliters, of refined coconut oil daily for 12 weeks experienced a reduction of 0.5 inches, equal 1.4 centimeters, from their waist measurement, on average. In short, eating coconut may improve cholesterol levels and help decrease belly fat, which is a risk factor for heart disease. Number 4. May promote blood sugar control. Coconut is low in carbs and high in fiber and fat, so it may help stabilize your blood sugar. One rat study found that coconut had anti-diabetic effects, possibly due to its arginine content. Arginine is an amino acid that's important for the functioning of pancreatic cells, which release the hormone insulin to regulate your blood sugar levels. When rats with diabetes were fed protein made from coconut meat, their blood sugar insulin levels, and other glucose metabolism markers were much better than those that didn't eat coconut protein. In addition, beta cells in their pancreas started making more insulin, a hormone that helps regulate blood sugar. Researchers suspected the improved beta cell function was also due to the high amounts of arginine found in coconut. The high fiber content of coconut meat can also help slow digestion and improve insulin resistance, which can help regulate blood sugar levels as well. In short, coconut is low in carbs and rich in amino acids, healthy fats, and fiber, making it a great choice for blood sugar control. Number 5. Contains powerful antioxidants. Coconut meat contains phenolic compounds, which are antioxidants, that may help protect cells from oxidative damage. The main phenolic compounds identified include gallic acid, caffeic acid, salicylic acid, picomeric acid. Lab tests on coconut meat have shown that it has antioxidant and free radical scavenging activity. The polyphenols found in it can prevent the oxidation of LDL, bad, cholesterol, making it less likely to form plaques and arteries that can increase the risk of heart disease. Some test tube and animal studies have also shown that antioxidants found in coconut oil may help protect cells from damage and death caused by oxidative stress and chemotherapy. In short, coconuts contain polyphenol antioxidants that can protect your cells from damage, which may reduce your disease risk. Number 6. Easy to add to your diet. Flaked or shaved, coconut adds a nice flavor to savory dishes. Its meaty texture and flavor work well in curries, fish stews, rice dishes, or even on breaded shrimp. Be aware that some brands contain added sugar, which you may not want for savory dishes. Be sure to check the ingredient label. Shredded coconut is great for baking, and adds a touch of natural sweetness and moisture to cookies, muffins, and quick breads. A sprinkle of raw coconut adds some texture and tropical flavor for oatmeal. Stirred into pudding or yogurt, it's also a delicious calorie booster for someone who wants to gain weight. Coconut flour is used in baking as a substitute for wheat flour. It's gluten-free, nut-free, and a popular option for anyone who's counting carbs. Because it's grain-free, the flour is also good for those on the paleo diet, which does not allow grain products like regular wheat flour. However, coconut flour is best used in recipes 
that have been tested, as it won't rise like wheat flour, and absorbs more liquid than other types of flour. Additionally, coconut oil is a delicious heat-stable fat, that can be used in baking, sautéing, or roasting. In short, coconut is versatile in the kitchen, and works well in both sweet and savory foods. It's a great choice for those on low-carb, paleo, gluten-free, or nut-free diets. Number 7. Potential Drawback Because they're so high in fat, coconuts are also high in calories. Depending on your calorie needs and intake, they might promote weight gain, if you don't account for the extra calories elsewhere in your diet. There still isn't much good quality research on coconut, cholesterol, and heart disease. Thus, while eating coconut in moderation is probably fine, you should ask your healthcare provider about it, if you are at risk of developing heart disease. Additionally, some people are allergic to coconuts, though this is rare. If you have this allergy, you should avoid consuming all coconut-derived products. In short, coconut is high in calories, so if you're watching your weight, keep your portions small. Check with your healthcare provider about eating it, if you have very high cholesterol, or are at risk of heart disease. Summary, coconut is a high-fat fruit that has a wide range of health benefits. These include providing you with disease-fighting antioxidants, promoting blood sugar regulation, and reducing certain risk factors for heart disease. However, coconut is very high in fat and calories, so watch your portion sizes, if you are trying to lose weight or need to follow a low-fat diet. Whether you eat it raw, dried, or as flour, coconut meat is delicious and easy to incorporate into both sweet and savory dishes. Based on your personal experience with eating, drinking, or using any products of coconut, please share in the comment below. Please, hit like and subscribe this channel, in order to ensure, that you won't miss any videos. Thanks for watching this video from the beginning till end. Please stay safe together, 